My name is Manuela Nilsson. I am the author of chapter six of the book on relational peace practices. And the chapter six has the title Colombian civilian and military actors perceptions of their relationship in the era following the 2016 peace accord. Uh, and in my chapter, I use the relational peace framework to analyze the relationship between the military and the civilians in Colombia. And I interviewed military and civilian actors, both state and non-state actors, concerning their relationship today, which is several years after the peace agreement was signed in 2016. I also looked at the Dyad's perception of the role of the military uh, and the role the military should be playing in the peace building process that is going on in the country today. So I found that these two actor groups have really very different understandings of the functions of the military in the post-accord period. And they show even stronger differences in the way they perceive the military, their behavior as an institution, and um, the relationship with the state and with the communities. So that leaves quite some doubts where the relationship itself is going, which is an important warning flag for international and national peace building efforts in the country. But it also highlights the challenges of the military's difficult transformation from a wartime to a peacetime institution. And we can say really all over the world in many, many different countries. And from a methodological point of view, I think the relational peace framework really helped me to assess the level of relational peace between these two actors uh, because it offers categories that are quite adjustable to the specific diet that you want to do in your investigation. For example, my particular focus um, on, was on that third category, the idea of the relationship, because that actually emerged during the interviews. That was my, my uh, starting point. And the framework really offered this flexibility to adjust to, adjust to the particular circumstances of my research.